Hi lovelies, it's Tiffany and I'm back. And today we're actually going to do an unboxing of the latest ColourPop haul that I've received. Of course I do have some other orders that I'm still waiting on shipping out, but I have a pretty good haul <clears throat> right here that I wanna share with you guys today. Um, I still need to catch up on Housewives, so no discussion sesh today but this is just as exciting i'm unboxing stuff oh my gosh okay so if you're new here I'm tiffany um this is my channel should i say well i put these on instagram too so it's like i guess either way this is my channel hi and um, a lot of times i normally talk about real housewives episodes and do my makeup and have a discuss sesh like I just was talking about. So if you're interested in that, go ahead and subscribe or follow me. And then whenever I put those videos out, you can see those ones as well. Today, I'm just going to unbox um, some ColourPop makeup. And let's get started. Thank you, everybody, for watching. This is so exciting to do. Um, I just love this little outlet that I have. So thank you to everybody that show support in one way or another. Thank you. You're the best. Okay. I'm going to get into this. Colourpop. Colourpop. Okay. As always, there's like tons of bubble packaging. Okay. So <clears throat> my first thing I'm going to open up is my So Juicy Lizzie McGuire collab. Uh, lip gloss. <laughs> Gosh, I just... Anyways, I have my Lizzie McGuire palette on today. It's actually what I used. Um, and one of the blushes, too. I should have just got a whole collection because I've just gotten pieces here and there of it. should have just got the whole thing, but I didn't, so whatever. So I got the Gordo um, color. Oh, very sparkly, it reminds me of middle school in so many ways, shapes and forms. I wanted to get the Ethan, um, the Ethan one, but they were out and they're out of the Miranda also. So I went for Gordo, sparkly. Um, oh, both lip kits for Sailor. Moon. I don't even watch Sailor Moon, but like she has a cat. <laughs> so, um, I accidentally ordered both of them when I already have Daylight. I have this one. So this is just another extra. So this has Usagi, which is a pretty uh, magenta I'd say kind of color and then this is a nice coral sparkly um gloss to put over it so this is the blotted lip and then you put the gloss on it and the gloss is moon tiara tiara did I say tiara <laughs> moon tiara excuse me I have mom brain pretty badly guys and I don't know I just sometimes my brain doesn't cooperate with me the best, so. So that one, I don't know if I said it already. So that was Daylight, the one I just showed you. And then this one is Moonlight. This one has bun head for the blotted lip, which almost looks similar, but. And then the glossy is Sailor Moon. So they're, they're pretty similar, I'd say. Let's see. I mean, yeah, they're slightly different, but who cares? They're cute, okay? And I like the packaging. I mean, I just, I love it. The little moon. So, it doesn't hurt for me to have both, I guess, right? Ooh. Oh, 
Yes, they're cheek palettes. So these like recently came out and they sold out really fast and I couldn't get any. And then finally they sort of trickling back in stock and I was able to get the extra glazed. So there's four shades. <clears throat> you got your highlighter, which this one is smoke and whistles. And then you have your blush, which is your, that one's pink velvet. Then another blush swirled and then strawberry strudel. They're a lot bigger than what I thought it would be too. So pretty happy about that. That's never disappointing, is it? Okay. Let's, oh, next up. Yes, they're Super Shock Shadows. I've recently, I mean, I haven't used any of them yet because, because why? I don't know. I just haven't. But yet I'm still buying them. <laughs> This one's called Moon Daisy, and this one, like, at first, I really overlooked. I didn't um, think I would want to get it, but the more I've seen other people using it, the more I want to have it. So, it looks blue, but then, like, on your finger, like, on the skin, it's nice and sheer. So it looks like, it, I think it'll be like a good color to use on top of other colors to add some like shimmer and, and um, just a little bit more of that glittery to a look. I feel like it's going to be pretty universal, should I say. Okay, now to get into all my new palettes. I'm obsessed. I can't help it, but like, I want every single palette that they have ever put out. Like, seriously, I'm so obsessed with ColourPop. By the way, they are not paying me <laughs> or anything to do this. I'm just doing it because I'm doing this and sharing it with you because I just am so excited and I don't have anybody else to share it with. So, lucky you guys. You guys get to be the ones to see it. Um, so yeah, just so you know, I'm not getting paid to do this video. I'm just doing it just to do it. <laughs> I bought everything. Paid for. Like, they didn't, ColourPop is not sending me products just to send them to me to try them out or anything. But if you ever want to, ColourPop, here I am, hey. <laughs> so very lovely. This one came out last month. In the middle of it, uh, May, I want to say. So, so very lovely. I held off on this one. And I didn't think that I would... I always think that I'm not going to, you know, get whatever one's coming out. I'm like, I don't need it. I'm fine with what I have. But then I see other people with, like, looks that they do with the eyeshadow. And I'm like, I got to have it. It's got to be mine. Here it is. No mirror. Here's all the colors. Now I've heard this macaroon cut shade is like super vibrant. So I want to see for myself. Ooh, yeah, that is pretty. Ah. No eyes. I like it. Um, I'm really into coral shades and especially coral and lavender together or coral and navy which obviously there's no navy blue in here but i just like uh, coral it's more it goes with more things than what people even i think realize so yeah I like corals oh okay now let's do this one's um <clears throat> off Melrose. This is another, this is one that I like was not sure about, you know, I looked at it a few times and finally I'm just like, you know what, we're going to go for it. So here's the box, it has some palm trees, obviously it's off Melrose. Mm -hmm. All right, let's open her up. Whew. 
Ooh, that is gold. That is gold, gold, gold. Mm, don't mind my band-aid. <laughs> oh, look at those colors, though. I think this one will be fun, you know, because you have good mattes, but then you can also, like, shimmer, shimmer, use shimmer to, you know, shimmer it up. And the glitters, I mean, look at that glitter. Social Club. Whew. Very glittery. Very, very glittery. All right. Now, this next one, I, oh my gosh. So, I've literally been looking at this palette, I think, since like April. Maybe longer. It's been a few months that I've been looking at it. And I don't know why it's taking me so long to finally get it, but I'm glad I did. It's truly, madly, deeply, which totally takes me back to the 90s with Savage Garden singing truly, madly, deeply. And like, I remember the music video where they were wearing all black and like at a waterfall and truly, madly, deeply do. I knew so many girls growing up that were obsessed with that song and it was one of those where it played so much that like I got sick of it so yeah I'm like one of those probably oddballs out of the age group I'm in that doesn't really like that song just saying anyhow truly madly deeply oh my gosh it's even prettier in person oh my goodness Look, look, look. Oh my gosh. Oh. Like, I loved it by looking at it on the site and the swatches of what they have um, posted on ColourPop. But goodness, this is like, oh, it's even prettier than what I was expecting it to be. All right, and then my last one of the day of the order is Bye Bye Birdie, which I was told I'm in a ColourPop group on Facebook. And if any of you are watching, hey, thanks for watching my vid. But um, there were so many people talking about how great this palette was. And I overlooked it a few times. So I was like, eh, I don't know, but I got it. Bye Bye Birdie. And my favorite YouTuber, Jamie French, I'm pretty sure has this and is also why I got it. Don't mind my two-year-old. Everybody in my house has gone through this stomach bug. Oh, it's been awful. So he's a mess. Hang on. Okay. And we're back. Sorry. He is just having a tough time. And he's two. So that doesn't help. Color pop. Bye bye birdie. There it is. And they're very pretty colors. Like, I, I think that, um, I think I'll be able to use this for multiple occasions. But I really like this one right here. Uh, Finch. And then the Heron Chic. Those two. Yeah. With a little bit of that in there. Oof. So I'm very happy. Thank you to my ColourPop group for always talking about what shadow palettes and showing all like that you like and all the different looks that you guys do and <coughs> Ooh. so thank you because you have really helped me go outside of my box with makeup um and I'm going for a lot more of like bold looks like this one I saw this on um, ColourPop when they released the Lizzie McGuire collab. They had a model on there and her makeup looks similar to this. So that's where I got my inspiration from. Uh, anyways, so this was my fun little haul. Let me hold everything up if I can. It's always fun to see if it's like even possible to hold everything. You know, mm -hmm. and then, oh my goodness, see, and it's always these that it, you always have the hardest time with. It's like, 
getting all of the palettes, all the eyeshadow palettes in. Let's see if I can do it. Wa-bam! Maybe YouTube will actually give me a good, like, thumbnail picture this time. Mm -hmm. You know, just trying my best. <laughs> Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for being here with me, for even finding what I'm doing remotely interesting. I'm happy to have you watching with me. And that was my ColourPop haul for right now. And maybe with my next one, I can do another unboxing. Well, everybody, I'll see you again at the <clears throat> next video. And uh, have a great day. Bye.